Marshall was home alone. Ryder had gone out to grab some more pup treats. Marshall was relaxing and enjoying some quality shows on the TV when suddenly... He heard some noises coming from upstairs, thinking that it is only his imagination. He carried on watching the show. There it is again. Marshall thought it's best to go investigate to see what the noise is. So he braved up and went upstairs to see. Marshall checked on the bedroom. Marshall can see the windows left open, that's what is making the noise. Marshall told himself. Marshall went over to close the window. There we are. Another mystery case solved by Marshall. Marshall proceeded to go back downstairs. When Marshall went back downstairs something strange happened. Suddenly Marshall was in an old abandoned house. He could hear all kind of scary sounds coming from all over the house. And suddenly the doorbell rang. Hello? Hello? Is there anyone home? Someone was asking on the other side of the door. Yes I am home. Said Marshall. Hi, my name is Hans. I have some food here. Ryder asked me to drop them at the house since Ryder had to run off to get other things. Could you please let me in so I can drop them off? Certainly. Said Marshall. Just hold on for one minute. I can't quite reach the door latch. I'll go grab a chair. Said Marshall. Excellent. Said Hans with an evil grin. Now where did I leave that stool? We interrupt this program to bring you... Have you seen this man? There have been several reports of a dog snatcher on the loose. Please be on the lookout. Marshall remembers seeing that face somewhere. He looks quite familiar. Then he remembered. Hans is a dog snatcher. Marshall confronted Hans and refused to open the door. Please let me in so I can drop off your food, said Hans. You are Hans the dog snatcher aren't you? I've seen you on the news. When Hans heard this he ran away. From that day onwards. Marshall promised to himself that he will not open the door to people he didn't know. Ryder and Marshall stared at the haunted house. Ryder put on a flashlight so he and Marshall could see better in the dark. Ryder and Marshall set off for the scary house on the hill to find the other pups. The house was very old with scary looking windows. It was creepy. Come on, Marshall. Let's go inside, Ryder said leading the way. Marshall nervously followed closely behind. Ah! 
After opening the door, they slowly got inside the scary house. See? That wasn't so bad. Ryder said calmly. Suddenly, the front door slammed shut with a loud bang. Ah! The pub screamed in fright, as Marshall hugged Ryder for protection. Ryder then noticed the closed door, and walked over to open it. Ah, Marshall! We're locked in! Ryder said nervously. Let's look around and see what's in the house, but we should stick together. Marshall said. There were some scary paintings on the wall. As they looked around the house, they found bed sheet covered furniture, dusty items, and knight's armor. While they were looking around however, they heard a strange noise. Ah! Marshall shouted in fright as he hugged Ryder. This place is creepy. Marshall commented. Yeah. Ryder agreed. Ryder shook his head. I'm sure there's a simple explanation. Well, this is the living room. I wonder if there's any information about the missing pups? Ryder said as he looked around. Suddenly, Ryder found a piece of paper with a list written on it. Ryder's eyes widened. Marshall, take a look at this. Ryder said as he showed Marshall the list. Marshall gasped. Written in pencil were the names and breeds of each pup from the legend. To be continued. water bubbles. Use this to point to the correct area. Then hold down to shoot water. Marshall, you put the fire out! Rubble's right! It looks like there's a missing fire hydrant. Like you'll have to continue on paw. Marshall, lead the way. Movement. Use this to move the pup. Great, but be careful. We don't know how much damage the fireworks may have caused. to jump to keep going. Jump! Press this to jump. There are a lot of pup treats waiting. Awesome! Keep 
keep up the good work. You're almost there. Don't forget to pick up all the pup treats you find along the way. to switch from one pup to the other. Paw interaction. Press this inside the circle to activate. Drill. Move this to place the drill. Then... as you can. to move the axes. Great work! 
Excellent. Route to move forward. Way to go. Liberty, you can use the scooter to take a shortcut down that alley to get there faster. Watch out for things in your way. Very well, all participants at the starting grid. The racing track is the perfect location for an exciting race. Pops, are you ready? No race is too big, no pop is too small.
Three, two, one, go! I'm ready for a red book race! Let's go, go, go! The next race! Next race! Have you already decided how you'll celebrate your victory, Pops? Dude, totally! Yeah, it's going to be the coolest party ever! I wouldn't mind a party too, but only after becoming the best bear in the world! Kittens, be ready! Two, one, go! I'm ready for a red box 
Oh, no. 